paid page boost campaign. Another way you can get a lot of traffic from Facebook is by using a paid page boost. Basically, you are paying for the promotion of your page. This is different from a page post boost. You're not promoting the content of your page. You're promoting the page itself. This is a great way to get page likes and to broaden the statistical demographics of your page. And why is this important? Why is it a big deal that you get a broad statistical demographic snapshot of people truly interested in whatever it is you are promoting? You have to understand that Facebook works best when you target people by their interests. This is a bit tricky because if your page is statistically inaccurate as far as your niche is concerned, you probably would have a very faulty set of targeting parameters. You're not quite there when it comes to getting the interests of people you're trying to reach. This is why it's crucial that your page gets a truly honest snapshot of the range of interests as well as demographic information of the people who are actually interested in whatever you are promoting. This is hard to achieve if you are just promoting your page organically. Maybe you're not putting in that much time in getting the word out about your page. Perhaps you are just sharing the word on several groups that may not line up, demographically speaking, with your niche. Whatever the case may be, there might be a blind spot there. This is why I suggest that at least at a minimal level, engage in some sort of paid page boost campaign. Make sure your page is mature enough before you launch a paid page boost campaign. Make sure that your page has been around for a long enough time for it to build up enough user insight as well as engagement levels for you to accurately target the demographic you should begin with. This is important. If you're able to pull this off, then your demographics will help you run more successful campaigns involving your content or your direct traffic campaigns. These are campaigns that direct traffic from Facebook directly to your target website. You're going to do that primarily using a lookalike audience campaign. Make sure you're ready for a sponsored page ad buy. When you're buying a sponsored page ad campaign, make sure your page looks good. Make sure you're sending the right signals both in terms of graphics and text. You don't want to waste your money, so make sure that at least everything looks like it's ready to go. There has to be enough solid content on your page. This increases the likelihood that you will get a decent amount of page likes. Where does all this lead to? As I have mentioned above, if you get a lot of page likes, you will be able to target your intended audience better. In addition to that, you may be able to increase your reach because the more people that like your page, the bigger your base visibility becomes. If a lot of those people actively engage with your content, that percentage increases, but you're still dealing with the reality that your content will only reach a fairly small percentage of the people who have expressed interest in your content. When you increase the total amount of likes you get, you still have that same small percentage, but the raw numbers are bigger. Believe me, 10% of 100 is definitely going to be smaller than 10% of 100,000. Which position would you rather be in? This is why it's always a good idea to build up your page likes. Hand in hand with this is the fact that you can profile your users better, as I've mentioned above. This higher level of profiling paired with better content management and targeting, on your part, can lead to more content visibility. How come? Well, your reach can increase because of higher engagement levels. If you pay attention to what kind of content people really like on your page, and you produce more of that content and you fine-tune it, so people are more likely to engage with it, this can increase your organic reach. This makes your content more visible. What is engagement? Well, people can share your stuff. They can like, they can react, they can comment. Whatever the case may be, get them to do it. And the best way to do this, of course, is to make sure that the right people are attracted to your page and you put the right content in front of the right eyeballs. Unfortunately, this doesn't happen overnight. It is neither smooth nor easy. It's one of those things that you figure out on your own on a trial and error basis, but you do have powerful tools like Facebook's Audience Insights to see which content is resonating with your audience members. You can't just set this up and forget about it. You have to actively monitor it. You have to look for patterns. But the crucial ingredient to all of this is that your page gets enough likes. That's why you have to promote it at some point.